investigation. Tonight, we are learning more about a man who fell to his death at Denton Shipyard last week. Our account on two investigators reveal this is the third death at the shipyard this past year. News 2's Sophia Arizosa digs through Occupational Safety and Health Administration files and breaks down the violations they are facing. 34-year-old David Clark left behind his pregnant wife and children. That's according to his obituary. He was buried on Sunday. He was the third person to die at Dedden's shipyard in the past year. And these troubling police reports raise questions about safety at that workplace. Police say David Clark was working on the top deck of a ship when a crane's cable snapped. An object hit Clark in the face, knocking him to the floor four stories below. He suffered severe head trauma and was dead within minutes. This death comes just seven months after another man fell to his death at that same shipyard. Three months before that, another worker killed in a workplace accident pinned against 3,000 pounds of equipment. OSHA cited the shipyard with two violations following that accident, the penalties totaling more than $15,000. On their website, Denton says safety is their number one priority. I emailed the shipyard for this story. Their sales and marketing director said they had no comment. According to OSHA, there are two open inspections into the shipyard, both involving safety. Following this most recent death, we received an email from an employee of that shipyard. He asked us to look into these fatalities and the penalties OSHA has handed down. He chose to remain anonymous. Reporting in studio, Sophia Zoza. Count on two.